Good morning, everyone. How's everyone doing on this beautiful, beautiful morning? It is a beautiful, sunshiny day, and it's so pretty. The birds are out, and uh, it's such a beautiful day. And I'm out here having coffee this morning. You see my uh, chimes over there sparkling uh, in the sun? I love it. Uh, I'm going to have a sip of coffee here. Here's your coffee. It has a red bird on it. So, y'all have a sip of coffee on me. <laughs> and let's enjoy this beautiful, beautiful day. Oh, it's so awesome to be out here this morning in its... Uh, Oh, I see a blue bird. Oh, let me get back to what I'm doing. I get distracted when I see stuff like that. <laughs> uh, and let me have a sip. Uh, see my butterfly on my cup and my flower. So pretty. Mm. It's very, very good. And so. It's such a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful morning. And this, let's see if the birds are out. Oh, yes, there's a whole bunch of them back there. Can y'all see them? Anyway, the last project I did, y'all, I uh, planted my seeds. They are coming up around there. They are just sprouting out of the ground and I'm so thrilled uh, about that. I, I've never, never planted anything in containers, but this is my first time. So, uh, y'all, what I'm planning on doing, this, this project that I'm doing now is, I'm trying to do, it's uh, going to be I'm gonna make more wind chimes. I, I I like them. I love them. They they are shining all when the when the sun shines on them. They they reflect colors and lights and mirrors and all that stuff. I love them, and I wanted I wanted to make some more. Uh, and I. I didn't have any more of those shells that I made those out of, which I had those shells and I, I, I wanted to use them. And, but now I don't have any shells, so I, I've thought up something. I've thought up. If I mix up some resin and I pour resin in a little circle and I can put stained glass on that resin and make more wind chimes because uh, I, I, I wanted to do something a little different with these wind chimes that I did with the other ones because nothing you do is the same. Nothing. You don't, uh, you can't <laughs> make something the same way all the time. But anyway, for someone that doesn't have the shells and stuff, you can make your own. And I'm going, uh, get my resin and mix it up and show y'all how to mix it and show y'all how to pour it and all that and then I'm going to put my stained glass on the on the resin and glue it down and I'm going I don't think I I don't think I have my glue out here See my flowers 
I don't know if y'all can see the flowers back there. They're still blooming. And these are some of them. They're not double, but they're, they're so thick they almost could be double. You can, out here, you can see those lights off of those wind chimes just, I mean, bouncing around all over the place when you're, y'all probably can't see it, but I can see it uh, when I'm sitting. It's, it's going across like, you know those things that you hang up and they turn in a ballroom dancing place? That's how these things look. Uh, they they shine, they uh, give off all kind of light and colors and stuff. I love it. So I wanted, I wanted to show y'all how to do it without shells that you put it on. Let me get uh, let me get the glue and some of my things out here and I'll be right back. This is my glue that I'm going to use. Uh, it's hard as nails, and it, it says it uh, dries clear, and it is clear. And that's what I'm going to put on my, uh, on my wind chimes that I'm going to make. So, uh, I see red birds out there. I see blue birds out there. Uh... The wind's not blowing. I know some of y'all are proud of that. <laughs> this, y'all, this is my peaceful place out here in my yard, and nobody is here to disturb you. And uh, you just sit out here and have coffee and watch the lights go around. <laughs> it's so pretty. Oh, there's red birds back there. I, I don't know if y'all can see them or not, but they're back there anyway. Y'all, let's have another little sip of coffee before I get started. Uh, I'm going to mix up my resin and show y'all just how to do that. And I want to thank y'all so, so much for watching my videos and subscribing and sharing and uh thumbs up and y'all y'all have um blessed me so much with the kindness y'all show me all always uh well every once in a while there's people <laughs> that don't like my channel but you know everybody don't like the same thing and you just have to do what you do and if someone likes it they they can watch it if they don't like it they can uh find something else that they like okay y'all let me let me have a, a sip of coffee and i'm gonna get started with my project and show y'all how to do this and uh maybe maybe you'll can make it because it's really simple you just you just pour your resin and you let it dry and you uh, cut out or whatever the size you want to make your little chime you you I'm gonna I put a little hole this one already had a hole that uh that one had a hole already in it, but these do not have a hole, so I, I'm going to have to put a hole in it, and then I'm going to show y'all how to put the stained glass on it, and then we'll see how pretty that is. I'll be back. See y'all in, in a few minutes when I get my stuff out here. Mmm. So good. I'll be right back. Okay. Uh, I'm going to pour this in here and stir it.
I'm thinking maybe uh, the light the light will shine through it better than that one up there because it, you couldn't see through that one. You can see the light a little bit through it, but this one I think is going to be maybe the light will show better. I don't know. You stir this a while, I don't know how long. I didn't read <laughs> I'm going to stir it and then I'm going to let it sit till it starts getting warm. That means why I do that is uh, it starts setting up and it won't run out as much. It will kind of stay confined more than it would if you poured it while it's before it gets start to getting uh, firm, I'll say. <laughs> oh, birds. Uh, and it doesn't matter if it has bubbles in it. It doesn't ha matter if it has wrinkles in the paper. Uh, it will be okay because it will be covered up. I'm going to pour it in this cup and stir it some and get all the, make sure I got it all stirred together and changing cups kind of kind of hip it a little so i'm going y'all can do this y'all can stir up some uh resin you you order it uh you can go to home depot and get it uh they'll show you where it is it's back there where the paint and stuff is and you can get a uh, resin and you can mix it up you just have to get it equal amounts equal amounts of one of it and one of it is hardener and one of it is resin or whatever i don't even know what it is but yeah, i know what you do with it i don't know all the details about it but anyway you go in there and get some and you mix it up all you do is pour uh maybe you might put a mark if you don't know exactly but you need to get it pretty close to the same amount because it they say it won't get hard if it's not mixed right and you have to mix it up real good and a lot of people worry about the bubbles and stuff in in their uh pieces that they do on uh, other things but in this project you don't have to worry about uh bubbles because the bubbles are going to be covered up with uh, stained glass and I'm gonna show y'all how I'm gonna do it and I think anyone any age can do this I mean it's nothing but pouring this stuff in here and stirring it up and that's not hard seeing it I just thought it up you know I I thought I thought you know you could do this with resin and not have to worry about getting shells or whatever people i don't even know what it, what people use to make uh wind chimes i'm probably gonna have to have two pieces of stuff because i don't know if, if this is gonna hold all the, that i've got slosh it out I'm gonna let it sit here and they they say I've never you you hold it in your hand and when it starts getting warm it's time to pour it uh one time I was working on a project and I just let it sit over there you know I didn't know uh, I didn't know how that stuff did I I was just I was just uh let it sit there and I wasn't paying attention and I I picked that little cup up and it was hot as it could be and that stuff was stuck like you couldn't even dip it out it done got went through that heat and got still and stiff and you can't you can't use it it's no good if you let it if you let it get to that point it's useless then 
Let me have a sip of coffee while I'm waiting on that to warm up. Y'all seem like I can't get around to everything that I plan on doing <laughs> as good as I want to. And y'all, thank y'all so much for watching my videos. Have a blessed day and subscribe and share and click the bell and uh, thumbs up. And I hope everyone is well and, and doing good. And I've been trying to pick up some in the yard, trying to cut a little grass and there's never no end to this stuff. <laughs> It has to, you know, grass grows. It never stops unless it's winter, and it's not winter, and I'm proud it's not winter, y'all. And I have some bluebirds out there in the, uh, in the bluebird house that's nesting. Oh, but I better check this stuff over here. It doesn't feel like it's hot. I can't forget about that stuff over there because I got to... Uh, and take this... I'll just do it right here. Oh, uh, I'll rake it off. Oh... Uh, you take this and you cut it. Okay, that's a little red petal. I'm going to cut five of these. This is starting to get warm, y'all. It's starting to warm up. Oh, y'all, I didn't show y'all my little things. Someone sent me these way back. And, and I'm still using them. You kind of pour them smaller than... Then you want them because they're going to spread some. And if they're not the way you want them, when they dry, you can cut them to 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 the size that you would you want them to be. Okay, you don't put any uh color or anything on it you just you just put your uh your resin on and then you wait for it to dry i'm going i'm going to take it in the house i think and because i don't want to leave it it doesn't hurt to leave it out here i don't but my birds are get in it and i don't know what i would i'm going to take it in there I'll be right back. This is not as level as my table inside. I'm going to cut some little green leaves.
Okay. There's a leaf. They don't have to be the same size. There's another one. It doesn't take long if you sit down and get started and everything goes okay. And you save your little pieces to use in places that you need them. You just kind of shape them. You just take these little cutters and you go around and kind of make how to cut one that resembles a leaf <laughs> that's what i do y'all i love making these wind chimes y'all that is awesome i love mine up there oh but i was thinking you know maybe that uh you could because everybody doesn't have shells. But anyway, there's another leaf. Now let me cut uh, another red one. I'm going to have flowers on it. Uh, there's a red one. Here's another red one. I think this is going to be absolutely beautiful when I get when I get it made. It's not going to be just like that one. Uh, it may resemble it some, I don't know, but it won't be like it. This is going to have uh, flowers or something, you know, on it. It's not going to be like random stuff like I did that. Y'all, y'all don't want to see me cutting all this. This is very time consuming here. It takes up you know, a good bit of time which I don't mind, you know, but I do uh, like to get through with it and not have to drag it out so long and, and make y'all watch it so long. To, all, all I'm doing is like you know, cutting these things, and once you uh, show you how to cut, then you don't care about seeing all that because it's just the same old thing. And then I'll I'll show y'all how how I glue it on, and I'm gonna show y'all the glue. Where is it? It's over there somewhere. I'll try to show it to you before I, before I go in the house. And it's not going to be long because it's... See the clouds over there, how the sun is setting. And and y'all, I think this is going to be one of a kind, y'all. <laughs> I think it is. Oh. Uh. I don't blink I don't think I've seen anybody making one like this. They may have because there's everything in the world on on YouTube. You 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 just you name it. It's on there if you can find it. Me trouble trouble I have is finding it. Eventually you'll find you know something. A lot of people are wanting to get on YouTube and do projects and, and I'm telling you. You don't know anything till you do it. You don't know. There's a lot more to it than it looks like, you know, and it's fun. I love it. I love thinking up new projects or trying new projects. And, and I know everybody is not going to like all the stuff I do. Let's see what else I what what other colors I got over here to cut. Okay, here's a 
Here's a yellow piece and an orange piece. And I'm going to cut on some of them. And, and you can't, I don't know. I, I don't know if I'm going to use this or not. I, 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 I would like to be able to see through it. And I don't know if, if it will, if it's going to be that way. But if I don't uh, use it on this project, I'll use it somewhere else. And y'all, nobody taught me how to do this. There's a orange one. Let me cut a yellow one. And then I'm, I think I'm going to stop. Y'all, I, I can't tell y'all exactly what I'm going to do because I don't exactly know right now. But I, I do, I, I have an idea. But, you know, it could change because there's another yellow one. I change as I go, it, whatever, you know, whatever it looks like needs something or whatever, I, I do it. I, I don't, uh, I start out with a thought and, and I develop it as I go along. There's another orange one. Okay. See all these little pieces here that you cut off? You can use them on little places that you fill in. I'm going, I'm going to have, I'm, I, I'm planning on having some flowers and some uh, little pieces of colors, you know, around it. And it's sort of going to be like that one, but not exactly. It's just going to be one of a kind. And you know, you can do things like... Oh, let me see. I'm not going to... Uh, here's a mirror. I'm going to cut it. I'm not going to make a flower, a mirror, out of flower out of mirror. I'm just going to use it to fill in. So, I got some of that cut. Okay, I'm going to put the stuff away now. Thank y'all so much. Y'all, y'all bless me so much. And <sighs> beyond my, my wildest dreams, y'all, it is so much fun when you get old. I mean, a lot of people, when they get old, they think their life is over. And it could be, you know, it could be over if you allow it. And, and if you have a choice, try to stay healthy and do things that keep your body going. And don't, don't sit around and get stove up and can't get up and down because, uh, I've had, uh, a loved one to let that happen. Um. Uh, you can't just sit in a chair all the time and have muscles in your legs to raise up. You have to keep your muscles moving and working or they quit. They 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 just deteriorate so so they're not strong enough to lift you up. But I know one day mine's going to probably get that way because I I probably wear mine out. <laughs> Cause I jump up and down all the time, but anyway, uh, just try to stay healthy if you if you have a choice. I know there's a lot of sicknesses out there, and they. Oh, let me tell y'all something. I had a subscriber. I had a subscriber that watched one of my videos. That my video that I uh, made chicken and dumplings. 
I had been sick. I was doing a video before it, and I can't remember exactly what it was, but anyway, I was, I just got to feeling bad, and I said, I was just going so slow, and I said, well, what in the world? You know, I, I'm not usually like this. And after I'd done that video, I got sick. I mean, I was sick. I got, I was in the bed for a week. I didn't eat anything. I didn't drink much. Uh, Cody brought me a uh, Gatorade and something to put by my bed to drink if I if I wanted to drink something. And I I sipped a little bit of it. I couldn't I could not sit up. I could not come in there and sit on the couch for five minutes. I couldn't sit up at all. I slept day and night. I didn't know if it was nighttime or daytime or what. I was sick, like in the bed, not knowing if it was day or night. And I don't know what it was. And Cody said, Grandma, you going to the doctor tomorrow? And I, I said, no. Nah. And the next day he'd say, Grandma, you you going to the doctor? You going you going to the doctor tomorrow? And I one time I said, Oh, okay. I I if I'm not better by tomorrow, I'll go to the doctor. The next day came. Cody said, Grandma, you, you going to the doctor? I said, Well, I think I'm getting better. <laughs> and. He was trying to insist me going to the doctor, but I did. Uh, the last time he said, "Grandma, now you, I, I'm gonna take you to the doctor." I said, "Well, I, I think I am. Uh, I think I'm getting a little better." It was about five days or six days, uh, and I did start to get to feeling better. And that lady saw that video, and she saw how I described nothing tasted good. I was sick. I was sick, 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 and I don't know what. I didn't know what it was. I'm never hardly ever sick, but I was sick then, and she told me she thought that I had COVID, and that was last, I think it was in March last year. And I got, I thought about it, and I said, well, maybe, it could have been, you know, it was it was around, but it wasn't a whole lot around like like it turned out. But uh, she she said she thought I had that COVID, and I I believe that I did too. I I believe that's what I had from the symptoms. I had no taste, and I got up and I was trying to make them chicken and dumplings, and I made some coffee. I hadn't drank any coffee in a week. I hadn't drank any hardly thing except Gatorade, just a sip or so. You know, I couldn't, nothing tasted good, and, and I just, and I think I had some fever. I just stayed in the bed and tried to get better, and, and, and finally I did start getting better. But it was a while there, and it took me a while to get my strength back. But, y'all, I don't know. I don't know, and I haven't heard anyone say that you can get COVID two times. I mean, I, I've been wearing my mask, and I've been uh, hand sanitizer and all that, you know. I, I, I just, uh, but I don't, I don't think I've heard anybody say that they had COVID two times. So if I had it one time, I might not get it again. But I don't know. But I'm I'm afraid to take a chance. But uh, a lot of people are not wearing masks anymore, uh, like the church where we sit six foot. You know they they have it taped off and all. And uh, but I think they're taking up the tape because I don't know why they. They, they must have heard that it, it's okay if you 
sit closer. I think people are trying to get back to normal again. I don't know. It's so nice. Oh, I love my, this is my peaceful place, y'all. I don't think I've said that lately, but y'all know it. Y'all, y'all heard me say it and y'all know it, but I'm just happy as I can be. I'm, I wish I could hold out and do more than I do, but you know, when you get 83, you can, you can only go so, so long and then you got to stop and rest some. <laughs> I used to go out there in them woods and chop and dig and plant and do all kind of stuff all day long. I can't do that anymore. I know, I know my limitations, sort of. <laughs> Sometimes I push them. <laughs> All right, I'm I'm leaving this time, y'all. I'll be I'll see y'all in the morning. Okay, y'all, I'm I'm out here with my stuff. <laughs> you have to move the whole house, y'all, and that's how I do when I go fishing or anything else. I I have to take everything I got because I might need something that I don't have. Uh. Here's some, some of the, and it looks dark in the camera, but uh, there's some pieces that I've already cut, uh, little petals and stuff. I'm going, this is my, my ice pick, y'all. Uh, I'm going to put a hole in it right here, if I can. And I think I can because it's still flexible a little bit. Okay. Can y'all see the little hole? It's right up there. Y'all, I can't keep up with nothing. I'm going to start sticking, sticking some down here. Okay, I think I think I'm going to make that blue flower. I, I cut five petals for a flower. That's what I do, <laughs> y'all. I I just think that flower looks better with five. Okay, that's five. I'm looking for my flower. I'm going I'm going to start gluing now my glue is a little bit but that's okay. I got it. I'm going to put some leaves 
around it. All the flowers are not going to be the same. Y'all, I'm still out here working. Uh, I'm going to lay them over here. I'll let y'all see them when I get through. I'm, I like one more. Okay, let me get started. This is not a fast process. But it's so beautiful. If you uh, stay with it and keep on going and, and don't give up because it'll be very, very beautiful when you get through with it. It's 80, 86 degrees, y'all. Pretty, pretty warm. It's hotter than that in the sun. Put my my little stone on there. Y'all, these wind chimes won't make any noise. They won't uh, disturb anybody, I don't guess. Uh, they, they, they like those over there. Now, those are glass, and they, they will cling together, but uh, these over here, These sound and those other ones don't because they're uh, they don't they don't have anything to to make them sound and and some people are like that kind because they don't they don't they don't like uh, the chimes that make noise. I do. I, I love them. I, I love my wind chimes. And they're blowing now. Oh, let's see what color am I going to put around here? Uh, I'm going to put some blue, uh, mirror stuff I 
I hope everybody's well and enjoying their day. Oh, it's good to have something to do that you enjoy doing. Uh, some people may not like this. <laughs> It doesn't take that long, but it's kind of a process when you're cutting your pieces and gluing it on at the same time. And But it's worth it at the end, you know, you got you got something that you've made that's one of a kind and even though someone else made something similar, it's not like yours. Yours is a one of a kind. If you if you make something uh it's your creation. And y'all, I, I am so sorry. I cannot remember all the people that sends me things. I, I, I'm sorry that I can't, but you know, I have a lot to remember as it is. And I, I appreciate it and I thank you so much for thinking of me. Sent me this stained glass. And I haven't used much of it because I've been doing some other things, but uh, it is beautiful. When you make something out of it and you uh, look at it and you hang it up and you made it, it's just awesome to make something that you can hang up and and it sparkles and it shines and it does all kind of things. There's no set thing that I'm doing. I'm just putting something somewhere. <laughs> I'm trying to cover up this piece of uh, resin that I made. Y'all try it. It's not hard. It's it's very easy. It's sort of a little bit, uh, when you first start and you don't know exactly what you're doing, uh, sometimes it kind of makes you a little scared about what you're doing and if you're doing it right, but I try it and that's how you learn. That's how I learned. I just kept trying and doing whatever I could you know and, and learn as much as I could from other people and, and some really don't tell you much but you know everybody don't do the same thing and 
what I like about this is it shines and sparkles in the sun and, and it's just beautiful. I want to thank y'all again for watching my videos and subscribing because I may forget it y'all. I'm telling you, I'm I'm really uh <laughs> I forget things sometimes. But I do thank y'all so much. And y'all, I don't answer comments like I should because y'all, I've told y'all before, I'm so slow at it. And I have comments on Facebook. I have comments on YouTube. And I'm just, I, I, I just about can't get to all of it. Uh. I mean, it, it takes me time to uh, go down and read them, and, and I, I I would love to comment on everyone. I try to read everyone. If I don't read them right then, I'll try to read them later. Uh, it's just... Uh, You know, when you're not used to computers to begin with, and my computer and my cameras give me trouble. And I, when I get it going, then something on there changes. Like, I don't know what changed it, and I don't know how it got changed, but it changes. You got to... Try to figure out what what's wrong. Try to fix it. Try to. Oh my goodness, it's y'all. It's just uh. <laughs> so. So many things to think about, and so many things to try to do, and and I want to do. Uh, as good as I can on it. But, you know, I, I'm, I'm just not, uh, I'm not equipped for all that. I, I, I just can't do it. I, I would love to, and I, I try to answer some that's, that I see that, that I, I really need to uh, answer people. Respond back to them for their sweet, caring uh, comments. And some people need prayer, and I wish everybody could be happy and uh, enjoy everything. And I know they can't because things in, things in the world is not letting you do that. You just have to find it, uh, find happiness, and try to uh, make make it the best way you can because. It's, it's so much tragedies that you you just cannot comprehend all the all the things that's going on that uh, it's, it's taking place now in this world it's just I just ask the Lord to bless bless us all and keep us uh, safe and and thank Him for all that He does for us because I never I never want to forget what He's done for us all. We may think we're having a hard time and all that, 
but you could it could be worse. And, and it never, you know, stays real bad all the time. It, it'll, it'll change. It will get better. trying to let y'all see they're all turning and I can't but anyway that's them and they're gonna be beautiful I'm gonna get a swivel for this to turn with uh, when I get it uh, up on a pole I'm gonna get it where it'll turn I like those over there how beautiful y'all I love them all. I remember them all too. <laughs> okay, y'all. I'm going. I'm going to go in the house now and stop. And see if it cut off again. Bye, bye, y'all. Hello, everyone. I'm. I'm Helen from Georgia. And I'm out here. This afternoon, <laughs> y'all. I'm sorry to tell y'all I was making a video and I was videoing it with my camera and I don't know what happened but my camera cut off a lot during this session and I didn't know it and I, I didn't know that it cut off y'all I I'm so disappointed that that uh, it did not get all that I did. I'm so sorry, y'all. I I came out and I showed y'all how to cut glass and I showed y'all how to mix up resin and I poured it and I took it in the house and I let it dry. I brought it back out and I took it off the paper. I unstuck it all and I cut the little pieces out a little more shape than I poured it didn't hurt a thing and I uh, started you know putting the glass on it and showing you the glue and showing you everything <sighs> y'all it did not get all that and I don't know what happened I'm so disappointed, I don't know what to do, y'all, about my camera doing this mess. But I wanted to tell y'all and show y'all, I, I, this is the box that uh, my resin is in. And this is, I showed y'all the kind of resin, everything I done, all that, and it did not t show. Uh, this is the resin that I use, and someone sent it to me. Uh, this is the hardener, uh, right here, and this is the, let's see what you call this, epoxy stuff, there it is, and you can, someone sent me this, but I, I you can buy it at Home Depot, and I, I have bought a lot from Home Depot, and I put, uh, the glass on, and I, talk to y'all and some of it's in there some of it's not so but I did want to show y'all the uh the uh wind chimes that I made from uh from that stuff it's so pretty and it's gonna shine in the, the sun's not shining but it will shine and I I don't I hate that y'all did I am so sorry. I I hate to be disappointed. 
I rather be disappointed myself than disappointed other people. But I think it disappointed me and it, it will probably disappoint y'all when y'all see the video. And I'm going to try to put it on. Uh, there's some good parts in it, but y'all, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Uh, I bought new batteries. I bought everything that I thought that would work. So I, I don't know if it was too hot or the cameras kind of set out here in the sun. And I don't know if that uh, caused that. I wanted to show y'all all. I don't know if I got all that. I just, I'm, I'm, I just, I'm at loss for words about my my project that I did. I, I try so hard to do a good project and sometimes it's just not possible. Just not possible. But this is this is the finished result <laughs> of my project that I messed up. I mean my camera messed up. <laughs> But y'all, thank y'all for watching. I'm going to try to figure out what to do about, about this problem. But uh, I'll get it figured out, I guess. I, I'm, just, uh, I'm just sorry that, that I didn't show y'all everything I meant to show y'all. And it's, it's just hard to edit when you uh, miss some of it and you put some anyway <laughs> that's life <clears throat> and that is life and the sun's not even shining where you can see the prettiness of of this and uh and it won't even shine out here and my other ones probably are not shining either because the sun's not shining but anyway i love y'all 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 be patient with me <laughs> I'll get it. I'll get it straightened out. I'll see y'all uh, next time, and I'm gonna try to do a. I don't know. I'll try to ha have it have the problem fixed. I don't know what it is. If it's not my computer, it's my camera. It's, if it's not that, it's my car or something. <laughs> the but that's life. That's you know everything don't go smooth all the time, and it. Uh, sort of shakes me up whenever I do a project and I try to show y'all every little step that I make except sticking all these on here y'all y'all cannot see me stick all that stuff on there because it takes forever if y'all try one of these y'all will see it's uh it's beautiful but it's tedious time consuming and hot and everything else out here when I'm trying to do all that. But anyway, y'all try to try to enjoy the the video if you can. And y'all have a blessed, blessed evening. I didn't know this was even uh, happening till I took it in there and downloaded it and saw what wasn't there and what was there. But you can see some of it, and I told you some of it, so maybe y'all can make out a little bit. Thank y'all so much for being so patient and kind, and I love y'all, and be kind to each other, and uh, have a blessed, blessed rest of the afternoon and night. Bye-bye.